All right, here we are in Photoshop again to do a demo of Perfect Resize 7, which is a brand new uh, version of Perfect Resize by All One Software. And the new version actually is uh, absorbing an older program from All One Software called Genuine Fractals. And uh, this program is now you know, capable of taking an image and actually making it larger than it was before if you needed to have a larger print made. If we go over to the image size here, you'll see that this image is a 300 DPI resolution, which is good for, or perfect for print, and it's uh, 10 inches, or 11 inches rather, wide by 7.2 inches high. The uh, dimensions in pixels is 3270 by 2180, which is fine. Um, in the past, if I wanted to have a larger print made, I would pretty much just have to use this, and if the quality you know, takes a hit, there's there's no really uh, there's no real option around that, but now I can actually take this file and make it 12 by 18 if that's what my uh, client wanted, or I could make it 30 by 20 if I needed to. But all you need to do is just uh, come over here to perfect resize, uh, double click that, which will launch the program, and it uh, should happen pretty quick here. Just a couple more seconds, and we should be into the program. And here we go. All I have to do in Perfect Resize is come over here to the document size and change it. So if I want a 12 by 18, I just hit 18, which automatically updates my height to 12 in this instance. And um, that's going to change my width to 5400 pixels and my height to 3600. And it's going to you know, increase my file size to 55 megs, which is you know, massive. But uh, if I hit uh, tab here, it's just going to trigger the, uh, the software to start going to work. And it shouldn't take long to update. And there we go. I have the new uh, file size here. And if that's all I want to do, I just hit apply. But you do have some more options here on the side if you wanted to add texture, increase sharpening, film grain, tiling, uh, gallery wrap, whatever you want to do. The, uh, the gallery wrap option is really cool. Uh, it'll automatically create extra pixels uh, on the sides if you wanted to do a gallery wrap. Or you can, it's got a different methods here. You can do a reflection. You can do a, a stretch where it takes the pixels and kind of just stretches them over the side. You can choose how, uh, how thick your stretch is going to be. And you would use this to create a file that you can then take into your, um, your print labs online uh, ordering software or however you order uh, prints from your gallery or from your lab and then just you know drop that file in and it's ready to go you don't have to use any special features that they may offer or anything like that so um, for this image here all I want to do is resize it and click apply and it's going to immediately start going to work and actually change the size of this file right before our eyes and um, you know the only downside to a program like this is the, is the time it takes to process the image, but I'm not really complaining about that. I'm asking this uh, software to do something pretty complicated, which is to take uh, a set amount of pixels and create more pixels, and that's not an easy thing to do. So I'm okay with a, a program like this taking a while. It's not a big deal. So, you know, I'll go play a game of darts in my office or go grab a coffee or, you know, return emails, whatever and just wait for this to finish. Alright, so we, now we are done. Uh, Perfect Resize has gone through this image and made it larger. And that whole process, uh, I wasn't going to make you wait on that. It took about uh, probably seven minutes or so to you know run the algorithms on, that, on this image to make it larger. And like I said, that's fine. Uh, it, it, that is not an easy thing to do. Uh, it's not an easy algorithm to run on, a, on an image, and I in no way uh, demand uh, uh, you know, a 30-second processing time on something like that. So I went and grabbed a cup of coffee and made a phone call, and, and now I'm back. And um, we will uh, just zoom in here real quick just to show the quality that, uh, that we retain. So if I go up to image now and image size, you can see that we have the new dimensions. 5400 by 3600 and 12 by 18. And uh, if I zoom in here to 100%, uh, this is the, uh, the image quality that we still have. It, it, it 
it still looks incredibly sharp. I don't see any uh, loss of detail or anything like that. So uh, I am I'm very happy with this. And that is uh, that is how Perfect Resize works.